Welcome back to this course on using Git for version control. In this short video, we are going to look at very briefly on the setup. Um, the environment has already been set up in the Unix um, introduction video. So if you have not already uh, watched the video, I encourage you to pause this course and uh, go back to that video and watch it. Katerina from the Computational Methods Hub um, in her introduction video has explained how to set up uh, Git on your computer or use uh, the Git um, uh, instance provided by Imperial College Software Hub. Um, so I'm going to assume that you have already uh, used uh, or you've already learned how to set up Git. So I'm going to now fire up Git and you can do that on your computer. If you're on a Windows machine, go and search for Git Bash. Uh, if you're on Linux or Mac, then open a terminal and the Git commands should already be available to you. We are going to work on uh, our desktop environment. I'm going to maximize this window, the git bash window. I'm on a Windows machine, so I'm using git bash for Windows. By default, um, the print working directory command puts you on the college's H drive or your home drive provided by Imperial College. So, but for this course, we are going to work for, uh, from our desktop environment. So I'm going to CD into that environment and typically this should be in C users then your username, your user account provided by Imperial College, and then desktop. And if you print working directory now, you should see that you are in your desktop environment. So this is where we are going to be working on um, the course today. Uh, bear in mind that if you're using a library machine or uh, any other public computer available on Imperial campus, the contents of this folder will be wiped out. Uh, so if you prefer that, if, if you're on such a machine, on a college public computer or one of the training rooms, then um, I suggest that you work on your home drive, uh, which is if you can just go to C, CDH and that should mount uh, the home drive. Uh, the home drive should already be mounted on all the college computers, presently running Windows 10 as of December 2018. If you are on your own Mac or Linux machines, then you may suitably navigate to your desktop environment. Uh, and that has also been covered in Katerina's um, Introduction to Shell course. So with that, we are now ready to begin our journey uh, for, uh, by, for using Git for version control. So see you in the next video then. Bye.